So I'm going to enter the area and check that the area is safe, which it is. I'm then going to sanitize my hands. I'm going to check the expiry date on the bottle, which is fine. And I'm going to use the seven steps of hand hygiene, which the World Health Organization recommend. Hi, Sophie. I've been asked to come and just have a little chat with you because um, you're having some problems with your urination. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. I've got an ache in my lower abdomen and I feel like I really need the bathroom, but when I go, there's not much to show and it really burns. Mm -hmm. So it sounds as though you might have a urinary tract infection, but we won't know that for certain until we can test the microbes in your urine. Um, so what I would want you to do is something called a midstream urine sample. Um, have you done one of those before? Um, I'm not sure. Can you remind me? So I've got everything we need here. So I'm just going to give you the, the urine sample bottle. The, the top just screws on and off. I'm going to give you some gauze. Again, just to remind you just to dampen that and give yourself a, a clean from front to back. Before you start, if you can just wash your hands and then also obviously when you're finished as well. And then if you can just bring that back to me, um, the bathroom's just around the corner there. And I'm going to open the urinalysis sticks and I've already checked the expiry date on the sticks. The sticks into there for no more than one second, making sure that is fully submerged in there and put the lid back onto the bottle. I then need, need to time track the results. And the first result will be the glucose. And that is after 30 seconds. And the glucose is one positive. Then the next one, also after 30 seconds, is the bilirubin, which is negative. 